Well, good morning. This is Larry, the Larry Fishes Tennessee. Uh, I've been down with COVID. Boat's been in the shop. I ain't been able to fish, put any new videos up. But I'm going out today with my friend Ernie in his boat. And uh, we're going to post some. We're going to catch some fish and post them on uh, our uh, Facebook group, Tennessee Whiskers. Y'all come check it out. Um, join if you can. If you like fishing, you like catching them big cats. Um, but today I'm fishing the Common River. I'll put in here at Clarkson Marina. And um, it's about 5 a.m. waiting on Ernie. He'll be here shortly. He had to get some fuel. And uh, we're going to go out here and catch us some skipjack or uh, some shad with a cast net. I'll see if I can't get that on video and post that for you. Um, sure have missed putting some videos on on my channel. I hope y'all missed them, <laughs> missed me. <laughs> but I'm back, and uh, COVID hit me pretty dang hard. Y'all don't play with that COVID. That's some bad stuff. Anyway, I'm all better now. You still have a little bit of of uh, tiredness and cold symptoms, but I've taken about five or six, four or five tests, um, and I'm negative, so I uh, wouldn't want to pass it on to nobody else, so I've been staying off off the water. Um, I could fish by myself, but I'm, I'm not taking my boat out. It's in my garage. I had it recently worked on, and they didn't do it what I hoped they did what I hope they would would have done. So I'm going to leave it there until I get a chance to take it back down to them. Anyway, uh, y'all enjoy the show. I hope I can catch some big fish and, and let y'all see them. All right. Now, just remember, always practice that catch and release on them big fish. I do eat them nine, ten, nine, eight pounds and lower. So... Anyway, let's put some fish in the boat. Be back in a little bit. All right, good morning. Good morning. We're, we done got on our spot. What in the hell is all, is that something swimming or is that a tree? Anyway, got my friend Ernie here. There's, there's, there's Ernie. It's a lie. <laughs> and this is Doug. Doug's fishing with us today. He is we one went, of our members. He's one of our members of Tennessee Whiskers. And um, we're going to... We're going to catch some skipjack or some uh, shad, gizzard shad. And we tell people secrets, man. And uh, hole. water's real low, barely in the current, but we're going to do the best we can. So just stay tuned, and I'll uh, I'll put some fish in the boat. I'm going to try anyway. All right, this is Larry. We'll see you in a few. All right, folks, we got one. Doug, Doug's got one. No, this is on my, my YouTube page. Doug's got him one. We always let the, the guests bring in the first fish. Doug, how's he feel? He's, he's on there. He feel like about a 10 pounder, 15? Right. see Whiskers, our guest has got a fish on. That's Doug on that mag cast rod, puzzle rod. He'll be coming up here in just a second. Slow down so you can burp because it's deep water. Yeah, look for the bubbles. That rod's bending just a little bit. It's a nice mad cat rod. I'd say he's probably got one 10, 15 pounds, maybe. Let's see what he looks like. A little bit. There you, go. you remember I got a suspended line right there. Yeah, that's right mm. I think he might have heard. Oh, he's pulling. That's a that's a flathead. He's digging. We got him on a fish. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's a nice one. Might he's going to get in my line. Hand me that pole, Ernie. Yep. I don't think he's already done got into it. If you move your foot, I'll set this for you. There you go. Let's get this fish on here. Yeah, he's got my line. It's all right. It's a nice fish. What's wrong, Doug? <laughs> Come on, Doug. Reel that it's fish in. Look at this pole bend. Look, look at this pole bend. Yeah, look at this pole Don't horse him. You got a knot in that line. Yeah. He's pulling drag, too. This is a good fish, guys. It's a good fish right here. 
This is our guest, kids. Doug. And Tennessee Whiskers is is what we're taking our, our guests out in. He ain't in that anchor, is he? Yeah. Oh, he is. Just go ahead and bring him up. Work him on up. I'll, I'll get him. That's flatty. Nice flat head. Yep. Oh, yeah, he got him a big one. That's about a 30 pounder right there. Ernie, you know what we got to do, don't you? Hold on. He's in the anchor. It's all right. Ernie going to mouth him. You want my grips or you want to let him bite you? That's a nice flathead. Ernie's got him. Ernie's got him. Oh, yeah. Give him some slack there, buddy. There you go. That's about a 25 pounder right there, 30. Let me see if I can get my line out of there, just, too. Just sit your rod back in there. That's a good 30 pound fish. Yeah. I'm going to set this pole down. It's, it's in the anchor, I believe. I think this one's in the anchor. There. You want to put your hand down his mouth? <clears throat> He won't hurt you. I, I don't. It. No, no, don't put your hands in there. It breaks her gill. You don't put them in his gill. There you go. Get your hand Hold him up there, Doug. Put him under right there. There you go. There we go. Yeah. Doug got him one right there. Sorry, I had to put you guys down, but I had to help Doug get his yeah. head in. He got tangled around the rope. Hey, nice fish, Doug. But uh, yeah, we'll get yes, back sir. with you. I'm going to get a picture to send for him, and uh, get a weight. Thanks for watching. Over. All right, fellas, we're going to go back and get another one. It's Larry out. Okay. I got a big one on here. Let me hand my phone off. Don't touch no buttons. There you go. There's a good one. Oh, it's a good one right here, Ernie. It might. No, nah, it's not. It's side. Yeah. It's a channel, too. I got him. Look at him. That's a keeper. That's an eater right That's there. That's an eater, boy. Look, he's wrapped up in my stinger hook and everything else. Hey. Yeah. Larry caught a fish off the right side of the boat. Woohoo! Yeah, dang it. It <laughs> felt like a big one, too, Ernie. I know the way he was pulling. I thought Shoot, it was yeah. That's the keeper. I'm going to eat that one. That's all right. We yeah, got, that's a nice channel. That's we got about a four pounder. The boat so far today. We'll be leaving here shortly, probably within the next hour. Let me, let me get a hold of him. But uh, I'm glad these guys are getting some fish. People need that and bring guys out. See them fish fish. I got three hooks on this. <laughs> he ain't going nowhere, is he? All right. Well, there's another fish. Yeah, thank you. Tennessee Whiskers for today. I got to get these hooks out of him. We'll holler back at you later. Thanks for watching, you guys. I'm not going to let him get me with them hooks. Open that mouth. Let me get this. Let me get that stinger. That stinger made him feel like a big one. Yeah, he turned him sideways. That's what it was. Yep. There you go. Now you're in business. Listen to him talking to you. Mm -hmm. He's like, put me back, put me back, Larry. Put me back. Catch and release. <laughs> Catch and release. <laughs> that's, a, that's a little two and a half, three pound eater. Uh, but we're going to let him go. Let's let him go. Yeah. You're not going to eat him? Yeah, I'm going to eat him. What the, uh, you got water in that live wheel? No, but he won't take a minute to get some in there, dude. We're going to stick around and catch a couple more? We're going to try. All right. I ain't leaving for another little bit here. That's a nice, that's a pretty old channel. Yeah, it is. That's a good eater. That's a long, two nice long strips. Yeah. Everybody, everybody yeah. loves my fish. I'm going to drop him in there. Get on in there. But he felt like a big one, Ernie. That's all right. Felt good anyway. Yeah. All right, then. Well, I thought it was a big one. Got on shad. I had him, a uh, stinger hook got him on the side on the pectoral fin. But there's one. That's an eater right there. We're going to eat that one. All right, then. Stick around. We'll have some more. All right. Okay, everybody. Well, it started getting raining on us, and the bike got slow, so we quit about 930. Um, it was really nice to fish and uh, have a, a guest in the boat, Doug. He's a member of uh, Tennessee Whiskers, and uh, 
he fished with us today, caught a 29, 29 and a half pound flathead. Um, I caught a little four, four pound channel cat, but hey, it's a fish. And I didn't eat it, I let it go. If I'd have had four or five more to go with it, I'd have brought it home and ate them. Um, but we had a good day out there. And uh, we had uh, my friend Ernie, was fishing in his boat. I'll be back in my boat pretty soon. Or another new boat. There's my dog, Bucky. He's acting a fool. Um, but yeah, there's, uh, there's a, lot of duck, a lot of geese or duck hunters or something going on on that river today. I didn't care much for that. They were shooting all over around us. We're on the water fishing. It sounded like Vietnam going on out there. Geese come by. They were calling them. We was driving up from one spot to another and seen two, two dead geese in the water. That ain't cool. Um, so anyway, but we had a great day. Uh, I was supposed to fish with my friend Ray last night. And my wife and I went to eat Chinese, and we're just getting over COVID, so she didn't think it was a good idea. And it would have been too late anyway after we finished eating our Chinese food. But um, uh, I just want to thank y'all for watching the channel. And uh, that's a pretty nice, nice... Uh, um, um, flathead, and of course, we when we take a guest with us, we always let the guest have the first fish. So, uh, today Ernie didn't catch one, and I got me a little little channel, but it's hard to see that that big that big flathead that pole go down and just reaction to grab it. But I hope Doug had a good time. He's a pretty good guy, and uh, that's in our Tennessee Whiskers Facebook group. He's a member of it that Ernie and I are, Ernie started it, and he's an expert and administrator, and I'm just an administrator. But um, we had a good time, and I'm going to go again tomorrow. Um, I'm supposed to fish with my friend Ray tomorrow. I really don't want to fish off the bank, and I don't know what the weather's going to be like, so I'm going to have to call him. <laughs> Say, Ray, <laughs> I know he's watching this video. I'm sorry, Ray. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'd rather fish in a boat than on the bank, but I'm sure you understand. Anyway, uh, that's my Mad Cat shirt. Mad Cats. Mad Cat poles put in the work today. Uh, snatched snatch that 30-pound that flathead in like it wasn't nothing. But anyway, y'all have a good day, and... And um, go fishing. That's my friend or my fellow YouTuber says, uh, Richard Jean, the fishing machine. Go fishing. It's good for you. Man, I hadn't been fishing for a while, and I, I feel good. All right, then. This is Larry. Larry Fishes, Tennessee. And I'm out till next time.